1.3 of our rules and regulations. In order to carry out the orderly process of this county committee meeting, I hereby appoint the following. A credentials committee, the chair will be Mar Marissa Soto. Tellers to aid in the tallying the roll call. Those tellers will be Anthony Perez and Eve Phileas, and a parliamentarian. The parliamentarian will be Mariella Salazar. The first order of business is to call the roll. In order to call the roll, I ask the credentials committee chair to please report on whether, whether the county committee members have properly signed in for this meeting. Right. The Credentials Committee Chair has so advised me and I recognize that a quorum is present. I call upon our parliamentarian, Mariella Salazar, to read a brief summary of our rules and the procedures under which this meeting shall be conducted. Summary of the rules relating to the procedures to be followed at the meeting of the Bronx Democratic County Committee held on February 15, 2018. Pursuant to, sec to section 7-4 of the rules and regulations of the Bronx Democratic Party, unless otherwise provided within such rules, the procedures for meetings of the county committee shall be governed by Robert's Rules of Order, newly revised. The order of business at this county com committee meeting will be speakers, only those persons who are duly elected members or the officers of this body will be permitted to speak to the issues raised in this proceeding. Recognition of speakers. All such speakers must be first recognized by the chairperson and must address this body by means of the microphone which has been provided. Number of speakers and length of speech. No nomination speech shall be longer than five minutes and no seconding speech shall be longer than three minutes. There shall be not, there should not be more than two seconders for any nomination. Voting procedure, section 2-6.7. All voting of this body shall be voiced unless the chairperson shall decide that a vote shall be by standing division or by roll call. We are here to nominate a Democratic Party candidate for the public office of Member of Assembly from the 80th Assembly District in the special election to be held on April 24, 2018. The chair recognizes Alma Jean Hill. I nominate the fabulous Natalia Hernandez for the office of Member of Assembly from the 80th Assembly District. For the purpose of seconding this nomination, the chair recognizes Joseph McManus. I stand to proudly second the nomination for the purpose of seconding this nomination, the chair recognizes Claudio Rocco. Are there any additional nominations for the position of Member of Assembly from the 80th Assembly District? Hearing none, I rule that nominations are closed. All those in favor of Natalia Fernandez as Democratic Party candidate for the Member of Assembly from the 80th Assembly District for the, assembly, for the special election to be held on April 24, 2018, please say aye. Aye. Those opposed say nay. The A's have it. The ayes have it. <laughs> Democratic Party candidate for the Member of Assembly for the 80th Assembly District. Thank you. The next order of business is the selection of a committee to fill vacancies for the Certificate of Nomination for the nomination of Member of Assembly from the 80th Assembly District. Are there any nominations? 
The chair recognizes Dejeta Pina. <laughs> we'll wait. For the purpose of seconding this nomination, the chair recognizes Diane Serino. Are there any other nominations? Hearing none, I rule that nominations are closed. All those in favor of Marissa Soto, Latoya Joyner, and Jeffrey Genowitz as the committee to fill vacancies for the certificate of nomination for the nomination of member of assembly from the 80th Di assembly district, please say aye. Aye. All those opposed say nay. <coughs> the ayes have it. And Marissa Soto, Latoya Joyner, and Jeffrey Dinowitz have been selected as the committee to fill vacancies for the certificate of nomination for the nomination of member of assembly from the 80th Assembly District. At this time, we welcome the new candidate for member of the assembly for the 80th Assembly District, Ms. Natalia Fernandez. each and every one of you who attended this evening, who voted for me with your eyes, and for believing me. Um, I can say now that you will not be let down. I look forward to serving in the 80th Assembly District. This has become my home with my family and my friends here, and I just cannot wait. So please keep in touch. You will see me soon. You will see me everywhere, and I cannot wait to get to Albany. Thank you very much. Welcome and recognize our chairperson of the Bronx Democratic County Committee. Please come up. Executive Committee, Marcos. I'll be very brief because we do have another meeting, but I just want to share this. Um, I remember the meeting that took place at the Bronx Museum in 2009 when I got similarly uh, selected by the County Committee of the 85th Assembly District uh, to run for the Assembly seat. At the time, I felt I was ready, uh, but I can tell you that no matter what you think uh, you're ready for, uh, this is much more challenging, and the road ahead is going to be very difficult. It's going to be a learning process, and it's going to be ups and downs, but I can assure you uh, that in Natalia, we have someone who represents the very best of the Bronx, who represents uh, the very best of the women of the Bronx, and I'm proud of that, and I think that uh, she is going to need each and every one of you not just with your eyes tonight, but to make a commitment to be there with her along this path, to help her. This is still a campaign. She's only the nominee. She still has to win an election. She'll have to run again a couple of months later when petitions go out. This is going to be a tedious, long, difficult process. Uh, but I know that in this community there, uh, with the leadership that is there, with Council Member Mark Jonah, uh, with State Senator Jeff Klein, with so many partners uh, who care deeply about the lives of the people of the district, I know that in the town you're going to have a champion who's going to make you proud. So we have to be there for her, not only as a Democratic Party, but as a community. Let's work with her. Uh, let's hold her accountable, absolutely. Uh, but let's make sure that, that we support her every step of the way, that we have her back, that we watch out for what people are saying, and that, and that in this process of the campaign, that we lend our support. Get the work, get the vote out, 
organize behind her and let everybody know that Natalia Fernandez will make this community proud as our next assembly woman. Congratulations, Natalia. At this time, the meeting is adjourned. Thank you, everyone, for attending.